It's a good thing you answered. I could probably use your help. Probably. Fine. I could really use your help. Can we meet? Just tell me when and where. You don't know how good it is to hear that. Swing by the Aldecaldos camp. I'll explain it all. The Aldecaldos? Thought you parted ways. Oh, look, it's a long story. Just hurry over. I'm here. Wow. <laughs> hey guys, my name is Lily and welcome back to another episode of Cyberpunk. Uh, yeah, man, if you didn't catch the last episode, I highly recommend that you do it. A lot of stuff went down and it was pretty intense. And I'm also pretty sure that all the music that was playing in the background was a bug. Um, but I mean, that's okay. I guess we'll go and we'll meet her then, right? Hold on. Okay, yeah, it's not a, um... No, I'm still curious. It's not a... Oh my gosh. It's not a main mission, but I definitely still want to do it, so we're going to do it! Oh! Hold on, hold on, hold on. We gotta see this. Hey, buried Evie today. Oh, yeah. We gotta go visit her. I think we gotta give her space right now. That's the only thing that we can do at this moment. Oh, wait, it changed the mission again. There we go. Hello? Hello, we haven't met. I'm Elizabeth. My husband and I, we need a somewhat delicate matter handled. We think you could help. Why call me, of all people? Any particular reason? You came recommended. Yeah, who by? I'd rather not say. Not over the phone. Is there any way we could meet? Discuss some details? Uh... Later. Sure. Let's do that. I'll send you the address. See you. I don't know what that was about. Okay, well, this is more important right now, because I feel like Pan Am is... V, it's good you're here. A main character for us, so I think that we should help her. What happened? Spit it out. The Wraiths took Saul. Oh. The Brick Brain ventured out with a small patrol and never came back. Sure it was Wraiths. We've been observing their camp. We know they're holding prisoners, including someone important. We need to free Saul. I don't know why, but I felt I could count on you. Because <laughs> her friends die. Always, Pan Am. You and me are chooms. Thought that was clear. Careful, or I'll start believing that. You won't be able to get rid of me. I'll survive, I'm sure. <laughs> Whatever goodwill you might feel, I'm sure you won't turn down one of the best sniper rifles on the West Coast. A Tektronica Grod. You saw it in action already. That and the gratitude of the Caldos. Sounds fancy. Once you have it in hand, fancy all of a sudden becomes kick-ass. Let's go. Mitch will walk you through the details. I didn't really like Pan Am at first. Well, I'll be. Pan Am and V, what's going on there? <laughs> but she's definitely grown on me. I think it's because she Her. doesn't After what happened care. To Scorpion, she shows up here? Dude. Probably for Saul. Ignore Say that to my face. Hey, Pan Am. Seriously? You really aim to do this? Someone has to. You know you have a piston missing, right? Someone has to. Yeah, like nobody else cares. So we're gonna step up and we're gonna beat some buns. Actually, how much money do we have right now? We have a decent amount of money. I'm gonna check and see if we can get some upgrades, actually, before we get on down to business. Okay. We got a little bit of stuff. Not exactly the things that I wanted, but Where's we can't afford You're supposed that. supposed to meet me here. He'll be here any minute. Who? Huh. Carol. You never mentioned seeking outside help. We can use all the help we can get. Lean against the car. Oh, let me just grab this, excuse me. Sorry. I'm a bit of a hoarder. Um... Okay, how do you want to do this? Quietly. 
An open assault would be suicide. Mitch is already setting up the recon. You'll sneak into the Wraith's camp while I cover you. Not going in quiet. Two's all you need. It's not that I don't want to go to serve some raffins up some justice. It's just... Look around! The last attacks left barely half of us standing. Our supplies are stuck outside goddamn Reno, and our gear... Don't get me started. We're up shit creek, static. And I don't know if we're ever gonna find or fashion a paddle. Try as we might. Leader gets nabbed and you what? Hope for the best? Rather not think about what you do for the ones at the bottom of your food chain. You're asking for trouble. Leave it! She has a right not to understand. There's Mitch. Hey dog, what's up? I floated a drone over the Wraith's camp. Will you take a look, or would you rather keep mouthing off? Mitch, how you been? Wishing duct tape could right all the world's wrongs. <laughs> and hey, it shouldn't be me occupying your thoughts, but Saul. You taking a look or not? Yeah, Let's yeah. see what we got here. The Raffins can't see it. Active camo, but that practically inhales battery juice, so make it quick. They found an abandoned cement plant to squat in, with a mass of heavy gear. Locusts would be a better name for them. They fly into a place, strip it of all it's got, then move on. But this time, do you see the wall? They've added some primitive security measures. It points to them aiming to stay longer. The question is why. Who knows for sure, but I would guess that Saul is part of the reason. If he's still there, we have to find a way inside. That guard post is probably connected to the rest of the camp. Our way in? Maybe, but there are also breaches in the wall. Lightly guarded sections. This is gonna be fun. I love these kind of missions. Hello? Camera's Do you see perfect. The tracks? Yeah. What the heck is this? Fuel tank. Tire tracks. Their vehicles were moving heavy freight. It could have been equipment. Either that or Saul's not their only prisoner. The tracks lead to the truck. Can you scan it? I'm glad I did. That's probably the go. one they kept Saul in. The main building, there. Saul must be inside. Quite a spread. Be like looking for a diamond in a hailstorm. If they haven't scrapped and gutted the place for parts, you could access the local camnet. You would just need to find the control room. This is gonna be fun. There's a lot going on here, and I love it. Skywalk. It connects the garage to the main structure. Okay. Got some stuff to work with now. Honestly, if it was just me doing the mission, that would be freaking fantastic. Yep. Let's go get Saul. Perfect. Mitch, is the van primed? I did what I could. Take a tour. job I mostly improvised actually either way it'll have to do hold on a minute I got one more thing if you find Saul hasn't flatlined you'll probably need this spike superjet a rhino dose it should speed up Saul's central pump hope so doubt I could carry him on my back so that should be everything V will you ride with me mm -hmm. yeah of course I'm going with you. Okay, you take the wheel. Want me driving? Yep, I need to fiddle with my scope a bit. Um, okay, let's hope that we make it there in one piece then. <laughs> Oh, yeah. We 
even have a radio in here. Take it for a spin if you like. Uh, that's okay. I, uh, don't really listen to a lot of the music on the radio when I'm playing this game. Ah! I still can't believe he let himself get captured. Anyone else? But Saul? Said yourself he's not at the top of his form. Yes, but moving civilians across the border during a bombardment? Hijacking a petrochem tanker? Opening the valves? Cranking a few figure eights to set the desert ablaze and give the kids a fun show? That's the Saul I remember. All had our idols. I know. It's just... <sighs> well, nothing you can really do, I suppose. Just do your best. See that? That is one hell of a storm. Looking, looking at that. bad. Oh, it's bad and more than its look. We have to move quickly. Okay, let's go no. over the plan again. You slip. We need to hide the car. Park beside that outcrop. Okay, out. I'll find a place to roost and keep you in sight. You just watch yourself down there. Well, this is gonna be so much fun! I wonder... how many days we could technically spend doing this, like... Let's see... We need to get one of those cameras. Eh, control? There we go. Get inside the camp. Okay. So the way that I like to do this is hack into the cameras and then just take out everybody from the inside out. It's a lot more exciting for me, but I understand that it's probably not so exciting to watch. Just because it's a lot of doing sneaky things and, uh, you know, doing sneaky things isn't necessarily a fun thing to watch. Penam. Found Saul, I think. Locked in the cellar. How is he? Uh, it's hard to say. Too dark. Okay, get down there and get him. Maybe we made it in time. Oh my gosh, I hope so. Okay. Um... I keep forgetting I don't have all my mods on this character. I think we made it. Right? I think so. If we haven't made it yet, we're at least right. okay there he is. I think I got eyes on him. Is he breathing? I think so. Good. Grab him and get out of there. I'm just gonna Grab the other things first, really quick. <laughs> Do you have my goddamn cigar? Your cigar? I 
told you, sons of bitches. A cigar, some ice cold hooch, and a couple of ladies to keep me company. Either that, or you can kiss my keister. Easy, Saul. I'm here with Pan Am. Pan Am? But she left. Not forever. I'm gonna get you out. You. I remember. You're that merc. You're pretty badly beat. Probably could use this. Uh, oh, yeah. So, how is he? Time to don my dancing shoes. Seems not bad at all. Demanded a cigar and some companions. That does sound like Saul. Now get yourselves out of there. On our way out now. I'm firing up the engine. I'll be right there. You. Got by the posted guards. Uh-huh. And if we can be just as sly together, might get out without firing a shot. Exactly. There should be a quick exit out of the cellar. Oh, dang. Looks like this sandstorm is really moved in. Alright. Where is that guy? Grab the goods and let's go! Storm is picking up steam. Good. It'll cover our tracks. Anyway, we have good reason not to head straight back to camp. There's no need to play it safe. We'll just burn time. Better late and safe than dead. Mm. <sighs> It'll just whip us off this road. We need to find shelter. The Ingalls farm? Good idea. You two know him? No one's lived there a while. Biotechnica saw to that. I remember this place. It should be safe, at least for now. Inside, quick! It's just safe. I just saw a thing about an assault. I need to catch my breath. It's so dark in here. Is that a gun? No. Just in time for dinner. Not hungry. I just swallowed a pound of sand. So now what? Looks like we're in for the night. A little power might be useful. Could you help me look, B? I'll search in here. All right, all right. A lot of useful oh. things. The angle's left in a hurry. Biotechnica made them a good offer. Yeah, prime. Sell us your land. You don't know that. It's so hard to see in here. I mean, I understand it. It's dark. No bulldozers, no backhoe loaders ever showed up. Lousy wrong way to get them out. Deal with the corp, you and Hey, it worked! We have lights! Oh, something shiny. Damn, it's getting cold. I tried to get us some heat in here. No luck. Can you check it? Might have the magic touch. Actually, you know what? Check the fuse outside. It might have come loose. 
If so, just whack it back in place and I'll get this junk burning. <laughs> Anything else, Your Excellency? Huh, I'll need to think about it. Though it'll be the end of our friendship if Saul freezes to death. Ah. Oh my gosh. See what I see? Expiration date's from before the last war, so hopefully it hasn't turned to poison. Today's our lucky day. Lucky? Interesting choice of words. Do I hear a lecture <laughs> coming on? Go on, get off your feet. It could be ours. No, no lecture. But we do need to talk. That Wraith's crap. It shouldn't have happened. They wanted everything. Our camp locations, routes, offloading points. If they knew what state we're in, one or two more raids and that'd be the end of us. And if you hadn't mounted a raid of your own, well, that would have been the end of me. <sighs> Not the time for See this. See that? You're both Thanks exhausted. Teeth, furrowed brow. Maybe you're right. We can't hope to handle the Raffins Thank alone. You. So you would sell us out to Biotechnica? Not worth digging up. Wait! I think so, too. If you'd like to what? come back, everyone will be waiting. Arms open wide. But there will have to be changes. No more jumping so to the front right. of the line. And so it begins. You know you what's know coming. Work in Bigger city. fucking problems. Got everybody Maybe a fighting war. For a slice of the street. We can't hope you to handle the Raffins alone. You so find you some stronger Biotechnica? Wait, tell him it's a damn rotten idea. Principles are the same out here. <laughs> I don't remember that. Hear that, Pan Am? That is the voice of reason. All I hear is the fucking wind. You know what, sweetheart? We'll have plenty of time to tear at each other's throats later. That is my hope. But right <sighs> now, I wouldn't mind catching a few winks. Need help? Fuck off. <sighs> huh. Do you know what they call these storms in North Africa? My boobs. Damn, I love that word. <laughs> oh, man. Well, what was that about? <laughs> to her boobs. Yeah. To her boobs. <laughs> Now that packs octane. I don't think that's how you hold a bottle. <laughs> Funny. What is? I rarely sleep with a roof overhead. Yet this will be the second time with you. When you're on the road, day into night into day, your butt basically fusing with your seat. You forget what it's like. And? Think this is any better? No. Just different. Yeah, this would make for a decent little motel, wouldn't it? A little fireplace, booze. Grumpy guy at reception is the one thing missing. Have everything you need, ma'am? Mm-hmm. I couldn't ask for more. <laughs> How's your whiskey, ma'am? Hmm. Warm. Subtle metallic aftertaste. Bold, yet smooth. Four out of five stars. Um, I did, I was curious about Pan Am, so I looked, and she is not interested in a female relationship, so that's fine. What a day. Um. Ma'am, I'm sure you'd be cozier with your shoes off. <laughs> After a full day in them, I fear a health code violation. Nonsense. After a day <laughs> as full as today, you deserve to kick back. Oh? And what did you have in mind? 
<gasps> She's not into girls, though, according to the thing. Got a few ideas. Think you know what kind. Uh, the. Yeah, say so she's not. No. <laughs> it's really nice as is. Let's not spoil it, okay? I. I'm, <laughs> I'm sorry. I. I don't know what I was thinking. Oh, it's fine. Truly, don't let it worry you. Right. <laughs> so, friends then. I think that would be best. Okay. And V, I am glad you came. It meant a lot to me. I think it's really funny they put in those interactions. Ooh, do you hear that? Uh, nope. Mm -hmm. The wind has waned. I can't speak for her boobs, but when a Chinook rolls rough and rowdy across the plate, I sure can't get any, should I? Not awake. Oh my gosh, she scared me. On behalf of the staff of the Independent California Motel, I wish you all sweet dreams. I actually like it better this way because I think that uh, this V is more of a Judy girl. And I would actually feel bad to have like a relationship with both of them. I wouldn't want that. I guess they're outside. Look oh yeah. Who's alive. Hey, it's beautiful. Good, all right? Good work, V. Old style raid. Saul doing all right. Cracked skull, six busted ribs, bruised kidneys, oh but he's back gosh. at it, bossing folk every which way. You? <laughs> you gotta agree now. Next time I choose the motel. <laughs> if there is such a time. Well, I slept like a puppy. That's a cozy shoulder you have there. <sighs> it's too bad I better get rolling in a minute. Hang on. Thought you were headed back to the Alda Caldos. Staying with the clan. That remains so. Come on. You gotta admit, like, she definitely enjoys flirting. Because... Last night... When we were talking to Saul, both of you spewed some drivel. But I do have to grant him one thing. The wraiths, the raid, it's the start of something we need to prepare for. Saul will get everything set up in camp. Whereas I... Whereas you... The Raffins wanted to know our roots, right? Well, it's the Alda Caldo's turn. Some recon is in order. One more thing. Your compensation. Please take care of her. She served me well. Where is it, though? Why are you not take? Oh, it's here. Why are you not taking this? It's it's pretty bad, actually. You're in good hands, Denim. I know. So, uh, thank you. Once again. Glad I could help. Glad I did. Take care of yourself. You too, Pan Am. And remember, I'm indebted. Okay, back to town, V. Headed up to here with this gusty outback. Okay, that was that was a lot of fun. I will admit the the storming of that place though took a lot of time just because I didn't want to be caught and so um but no I had a lot of fun doing that and thanks guys for joining me with yet another episode I don't know how much longer this is gonna go but I've been having a blast doing this playthrough and I kind of don't want it to end um but as I said thanks for joining me and if you like this episode please go ahead and hit the like button if you have any comments questions concerns 
Go ahead and put them down in the comments section, and if you want to continue following this series, go ahead and hit subscribe so you get a notification when the next one will come out. But until next time, I'll see you later. Bye!